we're gonna we're gonna speak a blessing over these children, and I'm gonna have a prophetic word for each one of these families and each one of these kids because God has put that in my heart as I was praying for you guys this week. I knew that this day was coming. I, I was looking forward to this because I know that if we can capture children young, that they will be an influence for God rather than being a victim of the world. Okay, so reach your hand forward right now. We're gonna pray over these families and ask God's blessing upon them. Father God in heaven, I thank you for little Colin right now. I thank you for William and Susan. I thank you, Jesus, for this family. That I know that you have a plan and a purpose for Colin. Lord, you have given him gifts, talents, and abilities that will confuse the enemy. And God, I pray that you would protect him from the plans of the enemy. The enemy would not be able to get within a thousand miles of Colin. I pray, God, that he would have a heart that would be ferocious and tenacious toward the things of God. And Lord, I pray that he would have a heart for the plain things of God. That he would be a man of integrity and character. A man that would follow your will and ways all the days of his life. I pray over his wife right now, wherever she may be, keep her pure and set apart for him. And when they find each other, God, it's going to be a blessing. And we're going to know that Jesus is going to be uh, uh, in, in the mix of this. And God, there's going to be a, a blessing right now in Jesus' name. I thank you. And Father, right now, I thank you for the Russo family. I thank you, great God, the Spirit of the Lord that settles on these two young men. I thank you, Jesus, so much uh, that the Spirit of the Lord is going to cause there to be a path that will be forged. God, I thank you that this young lion will not be, he will not be a trail follower. He's going to be a trail blazer. And in Jesus' name, Lord, I praise you and thank you that there is going to be a great sense of a King of kings and the Lord of lords that will be breathing direction on his life. Jesus, that he is going to be a man of God follow you, and he will not be tempted by the things of this world. When all his friends are doing stupid things, he's going to do brilliant things. I thank you, Jesus, that there's going to be a great sense of God's spirit that will settle up on that Russo house, and Jesus, the Russo house, will be known as a place where the light of God lives because he was there. God, I thank you for it. I thank you, knowing my faith, that you will do a great work for this young man. In Jesus' name, amen. And Father God, I thank you so much for letting us. I thank you, Jesus, that she is an ambassador. She is an envoy. She is a mouthpiece in the making. Jesus, I thank you that her intellect will be unsurpassed. That, God, you've given her a great mind. You've given her a great mind. I pray, God, that you use this mind to convince and persuade people for Christ. And, Jesus, I thank you so much that even now, as, as Joshua prepares to go down range and he prepares to leave in 48 hours to go serve our country in foreign soil, I pray, God, that her daddy would be protected and safe. I pray, God, that you bring him back to us in months' time, and he would just be excited to see the growth of his baby girl. Lord, I pray that there would be a great sense of promise that you would settle over a little later, even now she stands on the stage. Give her your favor and your blessing. And now, Father, I pray four things. A love for your word, a love to worship, a love for your house, and a love to pray. If those four things will be deposited in the seeds of these children, they will have a slam dunk, home run, successful life. Bless these children richly in Jesus' name. If you agree with that, shout. Amen. Yeah. Yeah.